Hi everyone, I'm Megan Timlin, the Academy Coordinator at the Entrepreneurship and Business Academy at Kempsville High School. And today I'm excited to tell you a little bit about our Academy Medallion that our students will receive for the first time next week at their cap and gown ceremonies. The Academy Medallions are something that are given out by certain Academy programs for students who meet criteria that have been established by the Academy programs. The students who will receive our medallions are seniors who are graduating from Kempsville High School and will complete the program of study in the Entrepreneurship and Business Academy. That includes the completion of all Academy strand coursework, completion of all Academy coursework and Kempsville High School coursework, graduating with an Advanced Studies Diploma, maintaining and graduating with above a 2.5 grade point average, Completion of all Academy program requirements, including master classes, service hours, their internship, capstone project, presentation, final EBA online portfolio, completion of industry certifications aligned to their coursework, and overall a student who's in good standing at Kempsville High School. So traditionally at the Academy ceremony, the senior ceremony, the students would receive their medallion and their certificate of completion alongside other recognitions that you've been seeing on our social media pages. This year, students will receive those items at the cap and gown ceremony. To show you, this is the Academy medallion that our students will receive. It's quite large, it's very nice. Um, and our Academy Medallion is something that all of our students who have completed the requirements that I mentioned will receive in the future at their senior ceremony. As this is our first graduating class of students, there are traditions that we as the Academy staff want to establish, and you've seen some of those over the course of the past couple weeks on our social media pages. We spent a lot of time learning about other Academy programs, attending other Academy, other Academy senior ceremonies, and putting together pieces that we feel are relevant to our community and would be appreciated by our students and our parents and our staff. Something that we've borrowed from another Academy program is the gifting of honorary medallions to individuals who've contributed to the Academy community, community and students during the course of the student's time in the program. Since this is our first Academy ceremony, our list of honorary medallions may be a little bit larger than it will be in future years because we are recognizing folks who have been a part of our program for the better part of four years. Um, today, we will give out the first ever honorary medallions to five individuals who we feel strongly have given to our Academy community and helped it achieve its goals far greater than we could have achieved without their participation. We feel strongly that these folks have gotten involved in our program and really helped our program take it up a notch and just be better than we ever thought it could be. So the first person to receive an honorary Kempsville High School Academy medallion is Mr. Bill Harris. As most of you know, Mr. Harris was the principal at Kempsville High School when the Entrepreneurship and Business Academy started. Through Mr. Harris's vision and the support of the school division, we were able to establish the Entrepreneurship and Business Academy at Kempsville High School. Without Mr. Harris guiding us along the way those first few years, I'm not sure that we would be where we are today. So we certainly recognize Mr. Harris. We thank him for his service to us and we honor him with an honorary Academy medallion. The next honorary Academy medallion goes to Mr. Adam Honeycutt. A lot of our students will remember Mr. Honeycutt as our technology education teacher in the Academy, our first one. Uh, he helped write and design the course for Design for Entrepreneurs. And behind the scenes, he was our architect go-to as we under, underwent construction. He sat in construction planning meetings. He helped select equipment for our Academy program, for our makerspace. He helped design a lot of the features and things that you experience today as students. And so we recognize Mr. Honeycutt's service to our program by giving him an honorary Academy medallion. The third honorary medallion goes to Mr. Bruce Thompson. Mr. Thompson has been extremely involved in our program and really came knocking on our door and tried to find a way to get involved with us. And through his efforts, we've created an amazing pitch night that has been funded by him. 
without him and his service to our program, we certainly wouldn't be able to have accomplished all of the things that our student businesses have been able to do. We truly thank Mr. Thompson for our, his support in our program, and we look forward to his continued support in the years to come. Our fourth Honorary Academy medallion goes to Mrs. Carla Smith. Ms. Smith has been involved before students were even in the building. She currently and has served for the past four years as the Friends of the Academy president. Ms. Smith has really taken our Academy program to a level, our parent association, to a level that I could have never expected. She's not only fundraised to provide $5,000 in scholarships to this graduating class, but she's left a substantial bank account for future parents and students in this program to be able to build upon. In addition, she's created service opportunities so that it's not just a fundraising organization, that it's a way for students to give back. She believes strongly in community service and has fostered those service opportunities for our students, knowing that service hours are a strong component of our program. We thank Ms. Smith for all that she has done for our academy and for Kempsville High School. And our final honorary academy medallion goes to a student who left us before he could actually graduate with us. And that student is Jaron Lejeur. A lot of you probably remember Jaron. Jaron is our first ever academy student to win a state title and he won it his freshman year in golf. Jaron is an outstanding student and was an outstanding leader at Kempsville High School. Jaron is graduating from a high school in Tennessee and will attend the University of Virginia this fall and will be playing golf there. So hopefully we'll get to see him. But Jaron left a lasting impression on all of us at Kempsville High School and truly made our academy a better program. And we're so thankful that he joined us for those two years that he was with us. So those are our honorary academy medallions for this year. We hope that you, all of you um, out there appreciate the support um, provided by these individuals. We could not be where we are today without them. And this is a small way that we can recognize their efforts in our program. We will provide these honorary medallions to these people the next time that we see them. We promise to post photos on our social media pages so that you can see them receiving their medallions. If things had worked out a little bit differently this year, this would have taken place in the auditorium at Kempsville High School and we would have been able to present their medallions to them in front of an audience, all of you, that you would have been able to see them. We thank each of them for the role that they've, they've played in establishing this amazing program at Kempsville High School. It's important for me to note, because I know you're probably wondering, um, that all of our current Academy staff will also be gifted an Academy medallion for the role that they have played in the growth and development of this program. This is also something that would have taken place at our Academy ceremony as you would have seen us give an Academy medallion to each one of the teachers that have played such a large role in your lives over the past couple years. So our staff will receive these medallions in the next coming weeks and months. Our focus right now is to get these medallions to you, class of 2020. We can't wait to give these to you next week when we see you at the cap and gown ceremony, get excited. It's going to be a nice thing that you can have. Um, and Mrs. Carla Smith has also ensured that you each get a nice box to keep it in as from the friends of the EBA. So lots of wonderful things coming your way next week. We hope that you've enjoyed some of the virtual things that we've tried to provide to you that would have been a part of our EBA senior ceremony and will be a part of the EBA senior ceremonies for years to come. Um, so that's it for today. I hope that you've enjoyed this presentation. Stay tuned. We ha still have some more videos and some more things to share with you over the next few days leading up to cap and gown next week. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye.